Hey folks, welcome back to the Coswell Collectibles YouTube channel. I am Greg Brown, owner of Coswell Collectibles. This week we wanted to talk about something we haven't talked about before, and I was kind of shocked about it, is um, World Peacekeeper parts. Um, we have parted out World Peacekeeper sets in the past and have certain parts, but one of the things we also do when we can is we try to buy parts direct from World Peacekeepers, aka MNC Toy Center, in bulk. And these are just a small sampling of some of these items that we carry, um, that we bring in. Uh, we actually started carrying them last year around November, and then we just brought in some this year. So I wanted to go through each one of them so you kind of get an idea. Um, again, this is only a small sampling of everything we, that we actually have on, in lo excuse me, online on our website. Uh, we actually have World Peacekeeper sets and we have World Peacekeeper parts. We have them separated so you can go shop the, which way you want to. So this item right here, uh, you probably recognize this, is like a Camelback uh, water bladder. Instead of in doing these in cloth, they did these in plastic, which is still pretty good. It has it has the drinking hose, it has the has the shoulder straps, it has the elastic that you can adjust. It comes in a kind of a greenish black color, and then some of them will have a little bit of a marking and such like that. We 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 note that on the product description. And I think that's why we got these at a discounted price because of the little stain right there. These are really cool tools. Um, these obviously came from the police line, but you have your your bolt cutters. These are static. You have your I'm probably gonna butcher this crowbar hooligan bar, and then you also have your your axe. Each one is sold separately. Um, to me, the axe has more of kind of a cowboys and Indians vibe for the Wild Wild West, but these two are modern. Great things to put on your Jeep or, or your ATV or whatever that you have that needs the equipment. One of the standout pieces from this series is this weapon. Um, I want to say it's an AKSU. Um, has a folding stock, just like the real deal. It has the Russian version of their grenade launcher. This is what a Russian grenade launcher lo looks like. It's different than the M203. And then it has a scope. The grenade launcher is actually removable. The scope is removable as well, so you can have the gun just like this. To my recollection, um, World Peacekeepers, AKA um, MSC Toy Center, is the only company that makes these. So we've, we bought them in bulk and they've actually been selling quite well. Another stock item or another standard item that we carry, uh, we carry the boots. Uh, these are just the standard black boots. Uh, combat boots. Um, they come with a little bit of dirtiness there, a little bit of wear and tear. Um, one thing to keep in mind with World Peacekeepers is they don't make a right or a left boot. It's a homogeneous boot that can fit on the left or the right leg. So if you get one of these and you go, oh my gosh, you sent me two lefts, you sent me two rights. Actually, we didn't. We sent you the Craig boots. They just use the exact same tooling for the left foot and for the right foot. This was a nice surprise when we got this. Um, this is a PRC a PRC radio Vietnam era. I thought that this would be great, especially if we're doing adventure team type of, if you're doing, gonna do Vietnam type of sets, or if you're gonna do an adventure team, AKA 1970s type of set, this would be a really great radio to put into the field pack and such like that. It has the handset and the whip antenna and such. And these are really priced pretty affordably. This one, um, anti-tank. Yes, I think it's anti-tank, AT4. Um, I don't know if we're still using this in the military, but they were, they were pretty common. Another great artillery piece that we keep, we actually do keep these in uh, stock from other parts that we do part out, but initially when we started carrying these, they we just bought them in bulk from straight from MNC Toy Center. Adjustable shoulder straps so the wearer can put it on there, you can put it on their field pack or whatever, but a really great piece. This one is super cool. This is, my, my memory is just fading from me. I think it's called the Dragon which this was also an anti-tank. But what's super cool about this is that it has the bipod that folds up and it fits there. And then the wearer can actually, you know, shoulder it and then have it, you know, where it, and this is the last company I saw that actually did this. I want to say it was Dragon back in the, the late 1990s, early 2000s. So it's nice to see these coming out from MC Tour Center. And it's a pretty accurate reproduction. And like I said, it's just super cool to have that that bipod that actually that actually functions. So another cool heavy weapons piece to have with your, you know, this this could actually, I wanna say they're still using this now. So this could go for modern special forces and modern army, modern Marines. 
never know when you're going to need an eagle. Um, this was kind of a kind of a last minute decision for us to carry, but we thought that maybe there might be some people that want to do Spirit Iron Knife, a one six scale version of Spirit Iron Knife from G.I. Joe Real American Hero. But a really nice piece, and it actually can fit onto the wearer's arms, which is a, a nice little um, feature. Um, we have carried chainsaws before from, and we still do carry chainsaws from World Peacekeeper sets, namely the Astronaut set. But the chainsaw is extremely small. It's more like a one-handed uh, type of chainsaw. This is a bad boy. This is a big one. This one actually has the, the safety feature right there, but it's actually a two-handed one. The other one is more of a one-handed, but this two-handed and considerably bigger. Very nice detail piece that you want to use. You can use it for um, a lumberjack, you can use it for your, you know, your Friday the 13th style, you know, bad guy or, or anything else just for a diorama piece to have in there for a log cabin. Another great diorama piece that we, that we came across that we really like is the guitar. Uh, the acoustic guitar, it actually has the strings on it. Very nice veneer on the front. I want to say this originally came with like, um, it was like the, the set that had like, it wasn't the Foot Locker set, it was the set that had like the, the bunk beds and the, uh, the, the, the actual uh, locker for the figure and stuff like that. But um, that set sold out, so it was really nice to get this. Um, you don't see many 1-6 scale guitars, especially um, acoustic guitars. This one I'm really surprised we haven't sold out of, but um, we have a few left. This is a 1-6 scale oil drum. This particular color is kind of a grayish color, so it's not all drab, but for the price, you can buy these things and paint them to all you want to. We have a little bit left in stock. Uh, we hope to get more, but uh, we really rely on MNC Toy Centers on what they have that what as to what we can buy from them. So very great piece, exceptional diorama piece. Same thing with this fire extinguisher, really great piece. You can put it on your race car, you can put it in your diorama, but what's really nice about this is most of the uh, fire extinguishers are smaller. This one's a little bit larger, uh, more visible in a diorama. And then finally, um, we actually just got these this week. These, this is a one six scale gas can. Every time we get gas cans in, we sell them. Uh, we get the ones from Dragon, um, we just had some in from Be Active Toys that are 3D printed. Um, I think those are almost all sold out, if not already sold out. So we went ahead and stocked up on these bad boys because everybody can use a gas can. You can use it on your Jeeps, you can use it in your dioramas. I mean, it's just a, it's a very useful piece of equipment that you can use. And for the price we're charging, I think we're charging maybe $2.99 for these. Um, it's super, super, super affordable. But like I said before, these are just a sampling. These are the things that we do buy in bulk, but we're constantly refreshing our inventory on MNC Toy Center parts. They're very affordably priced. And that's one of the great things about these is, you know, I mean, normally you, if you're getting something like this from somebody like to Hot Toys or whatever, you'd be paying $25.99 or something. I think we're only charging maybe $6.99 or $7.99. We'll, we'll put it down below what the price is, but, I mean, it's the, just the price comparison on these is just fantastic. And the, the scale, the detail on them are really, really great. So make sure you go to our website to the MNC Toy Centers, where it's under um, World Peacekeepers, and then you're going to have World Peacekeeper sets and World Peacekeeper parts. Go to the parts page and see the selection we have. It is constantly changing. We're always adding stuff to that page. So make sure you check it on a weekly basis to see what's going on. Other than that, uh, make sure that you uh, check the links down below, like and subscribe our video series. And if you need to leave a comment, feel free to leave a comment. We're always reading our comments from our viewers and we try our best to respond to them. Until that, I'll see you next time.